What's this all about? Oh, I think you know what this is about, Nick. Nicky man. What up, what up, what up? Surely you knew this was going to happen, right? Sad this. Shut up. What'd you think? You could rat out a guy like me to the cops and get away with it? Is that what you thought? Seth, man, it's not like that. Man. Shut up, rat. I'm telling you. Shut up! I wouldn't even... Fuck. I busted my ass to get to the top of the food chain for what? That a little prick like you tear it down? Seth, I would never rat you out, man. It's gotta be some kind of a mistake. A mistake. A mistake. A mistake. Yeah, Nick, it was a mistake. Tell me, was this also a mistake? No, 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 Seth, Seth, it's not like that, man. It's that fucking Briggs. He's a snake, man. He's trying to set you up. I was trying to... Of course you were, Nick. Of course you were. Of course you were. You stupid prick. Fuck! I trusted you! I got your sorry ass a job! And is that you were paying me? Nicky. 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 Briggs, you motherfucker! <laughs> Two kids. I want to see him grow, man. I want to see my babies grow, yeah? Shh, just, shh, just please. Shh, shh, shh. swim up the Mississippi from the Gulf searching for food. It's absolutely amazing what an animal will do to survive. Please, we can to you. Seth, one more time, just please. Cement blocks. Old school, I love it. Nikki, you should have taken the hard time. You got it all wrong. Seth!
Not cool, young lady. I was just practicing for my drama class. Yeah, Guess I did pretty good, huh? You scared the crap out of your mother and me. You should have seen your faces. You know what? That little stunt just got you one month grounded, young lady. A month? But that's so unreasonable. A month is a little long, honey. Uh, fine. Two weeks. Deal. Daddy! Honey, quit while you're ahead. Uh, oh, my God. It's your daughter. It's your daughter. Hey! <laughs> Daddy! There's some guy at the front door. Hi there. I'm your new neighbor, Clay Freeman. Let's move to next door. Hi, it's nice to meet you. I'm Don Kalinowski. This is my husband, Bobby. Nice to meet you. <laughs> and our drama queen daughter, Brianna. Hi, neighbor. Hey, Bri. Hello. Put some clothes on. <laughs> hey, welcome to the neighborhood. Clay, right? Yes. Oh, thanks. Hey, uh, could I possibly trouble you for your hammer? I can't find mine. My wife insists that I hang the wedding clothes before I do anything else. You know? Yeah, I can help you with that. Providing you've got a driver's license and a major credit card. I, I don't understand you. <laughs> no, he's kidding. Bobby! Oh! <laughs> This work for you? Oh, yeah. Thanks. I'm glad I could help you. <laughs> cool. Uh, um, I got this great spot that I do business with downtown. Best Szechuan in the city. Me and my wife are heading there tonight. You guys want to come with? <laughs> you know, I'm really not much for going out, Clay, especially to the city. Oh, come on. It'll be fun. What do you say? Uh, let me run it by the boss. I'll get back to you. We love to. I remember that one night. <laughs> so, uh, you guys ever been to the Mayan? The ruins? <laughs> no, silly. The club. Haven't been there. Yeah, well, the owner's one of Clay's biggest clients. Mm hmm And I kid you not. The Mayan is so happening that we're going to be there. So we're happening. Oh, awesome. <laughs> Driving. Sorry. Hey, guys, I'd be happy to take the wheel if you guys want the back seat. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> She's so Experience, Clay. There is no totally free. You end up paying one way or another. Hey, 
Ethan, good. I gotta go do something. I need you to wash a joint while I'm gone. You think you can handle that? Yeah, man, you know you can count on your little bro. Go handle your shit. And no screwing around, you hear me? This is a business. It is not your own personal dating service. Keep your hands off the customers. I got you. Hands off the customers. I got you. I can't help it if I'm a young man with a lot of testosterone. Have a little faith, okay? I got this. Whatever. I love you, you idiot. I love you. I know. I just need to know I can count on you. You can. Good. I'll see you in an hour. See you in an hour. Loudmouths and assholes. What more could you ask for? <laughs> Come on. It's like old fart. You're still young. Have some fun. Believe me, once we had our daughter, a night without being puked on or changing diapers is a good night. Babies puke on you? Oh, yeah. You're going to love changing diapers. This ain't no water down. It's the pure uncut. You make it sound like. She did a number on my stomach. Oh, well. I'll see you back at the table. Okay. Oh, 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 oh. sorry. Damn, oh. bro. You are the most beautiful woman I have ever seen. And I see some honeys up in here, let me tell oh, you. Oh, well. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> I'm Ethan. I own this place. It's nice to meet you, Ethan. I just met someone upstairs named Seth. He says that he owns the lion. Yeah, well, that's my brother, you know. We own it together. I let him handle the food and uh, take care of all the hospitality. Oh, well, it's nice meeting you, Ethan. Hey, baby, where are you going? You in my club, so I know you're looking to have a good time. How about you come check out my office? Um, actually, I can't. I have to get back to my husband. Hey, baby, come on. I'm just trying to be friendly. Come on. Do you like to slide the ropes? What? I got some great shit. What? No, I I, I don't do drugs. Oh, baby, come on. Fucking asshole. Oh. Oh, I like it rough. You oh, aggressive baby. ones, huh? No! Get off! Ah! Come on, oh my bitch. god! Come on. Ah! Oh, ah! Where's Dawn? I don't know. She left the ladies' room before I did. She should have been back by now.
Bobby, that's Ethan. That's Seth's brother. This is not good. This is not good. Looks like you had a good day, Humbert. So what do I need to know? Well, everything's good right now, but you need to uh, screen your boys a little more carefully. You got lucky today. Was able to intervene. Might not be so lucky next time. Yeah, right. Rat bastards. Can't trust anybody nowadays, can you, Briggs? Jesus fucking Christ, what do you do now? All right, look, I gotta roll. It's my little brother, again. Ethan. The little bastard can't keep his prick in his pants. Just, um, remember what I said, sir. You can count on it. Let's roll. Come in here, sir. Like hell I can. I'm set for it in my club. Sir, please. Please. What happened? Are you Seth Bordas? That's right. What happened? I'm sorry, Mr. Bordas. Your brother's dead. Ethan! 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 Get out of here, Ethan! Ethan! Who did this? Who did this? He asked me if I wanted to go to his office and do some coke. And I said no. Dawn left the ladies' room before me, and when I got back to the table, she wasn't there. Bobby got worried, so he went to go look for her. Why stab him? What are you talking about? I didn't stab him. He came at me with a knife. So it was his knife? Yeah. Of course it was his knife. Well, how did his knife end up in his chest? How'd that happen? I stepped to the side. He tripped and fell on it, I guess. This guy was out of his mind. I was just defending myself. Can you be a little more specific? What do you want me to say? That he tried to rape me? Suppose I told you I had a witness. Says you did stab him. Well, I'd say you and your witness are full of shit. So you charge me with something, or am I out of here? Get you anything? A water, a coffee. My wife. I want to see my wife. Where is she? You're gonna see her. So what do you think? Stories match. He hasn't lawyered up. 
thing is just like you're saying, self-defense. I mean, Boris was a train wreck anyway, man. This was inevitable. Ain't that the truth? If old Ethan was found dead in a ditch, we wouldn't have the personnel to interview all the likely suspects. <laughs> right. What about fingerprints? Only fingerprints on that knife belong to Ethan Boris. Okay. Cut him loose. Briggs. Talk to me. What did you find out? It looks like self-defense. Hey, look, you know Ethan better than anybody. What? I want that rat bastard's head on a stake. You hear me, Briggs? You hold on to him until you fucking hear from me. Too late. We just released him. God damn it! Listen, Seth, don't do anything stupid. Anything happens to this guy, cops will be all over you, and there won't be a damn thing I can do about it. Son of a bitch! Seth. Looks like I gotta take care of this myself. Want us to go pick him up? It's too late for that. The idiot Briggs let him go. All right. I want you to put the word out on the street. 100K cash for anyone who brings me Bobby Kalinowski. The city is officially on lockdown. What about your friend, the booze guy? He brought death into my house. If he gets in the way, kill him. But I want Bobby Kalinowski alive. Now get out of here. Grand, I get set board as my mom. Four hundred grand? Yeah, sure. Let's get this paper, man. Yeah. All right, then. I get in and out, no violence attached. But I'm not to be messed with. I promise you that. Ask anyone I work with, they vouch for me. The job done every time, no doubt with me. Move to the states and I set up shop. Say my name in any state, but they get up, watch out in LA. They know the man for the job. Independent, but made money for the mob. And I earn my respect for my right, work then. I put in. Now they show Sounds me good. respect because they know where I've been. I'm the one you need to call. Call when you need a job. I'm the one you need to call. Call when you need a job. I'm the one you need to call. Bobby, 
what are you doing, man? I'll distract them. Clay, get the girls out of here. Take them to the police station. No, Bobby, I'm not going to leave you. Dawn, please. Forget it. OK, listen. I'll meet you at 7th and Oak in 10 minutes. Don't wait one second longer. In ten minutes. We're not leaving him, Clay. <gasps> oh my God, Bobby! Oh. oh my God, are you hurt? It's nothing. Come on, baby. I've hurt myself for a shave. Oh. Relax, relax, relax. We gotta go, Clay. Elise, out of the car. Okay. I I'm not leaving my car in this neighborhood. They know this car. Come on, man. I'm sorry. Leave it. back to the police station. So how do you know he was dead if you didn't check him? He fell off the side of a building and splattered like a bug. Briggs, what'd you find out? Understood. Let me know when you find them. Nobody, but nobody could have survived that fall. Oh! You stupid fucking moron. I tell you I want him alive, and you try to kill him. Now I find out you can't even do that. Apparently, you both don't know the difference between dead or alive. Marcus! It's really not that difficult. Dead. Alive. Dead. Alive. Dead. No! No! We'll get him, I, I swear! Alive. Let's look at the GPS, nigga. Nah, man, I ain't give you my GPS. I just got this jump off, man. Man, give me the GPS. 
Fuck. Y'all quit bullshit, man. We don't need no GPS. These motherfuckers is on foot. With some bitches, they can't be no further than what? A couple blocks north of Washington. Oh, so you accomplished that. Look, man, let's do this to G. Let's hit these streets. Feel me? Ask a few people. Yeah, straight, boss. It's bumps, man. Yeah, damn right, that's straight. Let's roll, my nigga. Rich crackers want the land. They are the group developer. Shit, still no signal. Okay, the police station's like two blocks that way. I think if we cut through here, we won't be seen. Damn it, Clay, get back here, you'll get spotted. No, I think I'm getting a signal. Clay! Don't even think about moving. Put your fucking hands up in the air, stupid. Hey, D, call T, let him know we got him. Make sure he got that cash ASAP. Got you, my nigga. Make sure we get paid. Hey, man, what you doing out here, Black? Huh? Hanging out with these cats. You know you can get six feet deep for that? You hanging out with American folks, won't it? You a dead man walking, homies. D, what's up with T, man? He got that cheese, huh? Yeah, yo, this what? Cheese? Money. I have money. I have $500 cash. $500? That man right there is worth a hundred grand. But since you're feeling so generous and all, you want to give me $500. Matter of fact, I'll take that. And your watch, and your ring. Give me all that shit. That's, that's the polo jacket, huh? Oh, yeah, yeah. Give me all of that shit. Underlay, underlay, nigga. Move. You too, muscle man. I want your shit too. Let's go. The credit card's all the gift. Give me that shit. The fuck you laughing at, man? I bet it won't be so funny if I put this gun in your mouth, boy. So what the fuck you laughing at, huh? 100 Gs. That's right, bitch. Your ass is worth 100 grand on the streets right now. So what you think about that? You guys like working for minimum wage? I should pop your ass for working here. Shoot me, you lose the 100K and the diamonds. Diamonds? What you talking about diamonds, man? We don't know nothing about no diamonds, man. The diamonds that are stuffed in my sock. What do you think this is about? You think we're stupid, huh? No. You're a genius. Here, see for yourself. Hey, 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 don't move, boy. Almost got shot right now. Don't be moving. Quest, man, you think you're serious about these diamonds, man? I mean, that just don't make no sense to me. He in this neighborhood at this time with a whole bunch of diamonds. What you think, dog? Maybe that's what Borders wanted them for. The diamonds. Diamonds could be a lot more green than cesspan. Think about that. No. Check it out. All right, you got me? Got you. All right. Well, keep your hands up, man. Clay, get in the car. Let's go, ladies. Where did you learn to fight like that? I watch a lot of Jackie Chan movies. Get in the car. What are you doing? I'm taking my cheese and my watch. And we've come a long way from slavery to Obama. You need to stop using the N-word. It's disrespectful. Excuse me. 
We need to see someone in charge. Now, uh, that'd be me. Can I help you? Yeah. I'm Bobby Kalinowski. You need Kalinowski? You... That's right. Come with me. Oh, wait. We were just attacked. Ma'am, please. Just follow me. Okay, you want to tell me what's going on? Seth Bordas is trying to kill us. Trying to kill you? No, he paid 100000 to have us killed. And you have proof of that? The guys who attacked us said they were hired by Bordas. Attacked you? We were held at gunpoint. Listen, I'm going to get some detectives in here to take your statements. You know and what? We'll... How about this? No more detectives, no more statements. Let's go home. I cannot help you unless you're willing to file charges. That's okay. I don't need your help. Special services, why didn't you say something in the first place? Didn't think it was necessary. Okay, look, I will personally look into your story and I'll get back to you as soon as I find out something, okay? At least let me get you a ride home. Now, are you going to take us home in a police car? Well, yeah, sorry, department policy. But don't worry, the city will pick up the tab. Cool. My cell number's on the back of this. If you need anything, give me a call. Thank you, Detective. Rough night, eh? Are you sure you know where you're going? Yes, ma'am. I know it well. Not a lot of people go to Burbs. I go over the bridge, take the back road, Sitka Moor. Hey, do you mind keeping your eyes on the road? Oh. Yes, sir. I hope my car's okay. Oh, must be the wife. Good Lord, go give me that you're not taking the freeway? Uh, no, yeah, yes, sir. I have to go to the gas station. I have to relieve myself real quick. You couldn't have done that before you picked us up. Oh, sir, nature calls when nature calls, okay? Make it quick, huh? Yeah, yes, sir, I will. Just make it fast, huh? Oh, look, I promise I'll be very quick. So you don't want to grab a sandwich while you're at it? Uh, oh, no, thank you. I already have eaten. Oh, we got company. I am not a fan of downtown. Bobby, what, what are you doing? <laughs> Stay in the car. Going someplace, buddy? You know, I'm actually just on my way home. You guys seem to have accidentally blocked me in. Oh. Am I moving? <laughs> You're a real funny guy, huh? But, uh, you going with us, man. You know, I'm really not having a good night tonight. Up until now, I, I think I've done a pretty good job of keeping my sense of humor. But I feel like I'm starting to lose it. So how about this? How about you take your gang of goofballs here, and you get out of my way before you find out what happens when I lose my sense of humor. You know, maybe you really need to take that up with an animal over here. Yeah? You must be animal. Animal's a big dude. <laughs> yeah. 
real big. I bet you can help me get all these fellows out of my way. <laughs> Tell you what, animal, I got another idea. Pick a hand. Now why don't we just fuck your ass up? <laughs> <laughs> What are you doing? We gotta separate. It's only me they're after. Wait, Bobby, no! Clay, I need you to take the wheel. Yeah, I don't think this is a really good idea, Bobby. Please, don't leave me. Yeah, come on, Mason. Since your wife, you should stay with us. What? I don't... Clay, I need you to get in the front seat, now. Bobby, this is absolutely crazy! Honey, listen, I'll be fine. I need you to just go home and wait for me, okay? I'll see you there shortly. Clay, get them out of here. Don't stop for anything. Don't trust anyone. I'm counting on you. What are you going to do? Call in an old debt. Short two cases of vodka on my last order. I want my booze, or I want my fucking money back by Friday. Jeez. I must look like some asshole that everybody wants to fuck. What's up, BR? Bobby fucking K. In my place. I know this is gonna be good. I need to talk to you, bro. Alone. Believe this guy. I haven't seen him in a hundred years, and he comes in here barking orders. We're not in the Navy anymore. And you're not in charge here. This is my place. What's the matter? Don't like girls? Ronnie. That's all right. Go ahead and make some money. About a dance. No, thank you. I lost. What are you doing on the side of town anyway, Bobby? Thought you were a family man, though. I don't want to be down here. A neighbor invited Dawn and I to a club, and I got into some trouble. What kind of trouble? 
You know this guy, Seth? Ortiz? Yeah, that's him. He put a hundred grand on my head. You're the guy that killed Ethan? I didn't kill him. Look, Bobby, man, anybody but Seth fucking Bordas. I can't help you, bro. Sorry. BR, maybe you got short-term memory, but uh, you owe me. Look, man, you heard of three strikes and you're out? I've got four. Sorry. Maybe you don't remember, but you wouldn't be alive to get those strikes if it wasn't for me. Yeah, I remember. You don't remember. Where you been all these years? You got a wife now, a daughter, right? Have I ever met him? Hell no. What's the last time you popped your head in here and said, hey, Big Ronnie, you want to come over for dinner? How about never? So don't walk in here like we're family. You know what? Why don't you just get the fuck out of here before I collect that bounty myself? Do you want us to come in and wait with you? No, no, no. Um, I'm gonna be all right. We're right next door if you need anything. Um, please let us know the minute you hear from Bobby, okay? Okay, I will. All right. You gotta stop tearing up the town, Seth. Let it go. I can't let it go. I wanna know where Bobby Kalinowski lives. I'm sorry, Seth, I can't do that. Oh, so what do we got here? A crooked cop with a conscience? Is that what you're telling me? Look, I have some new information on this Kalinowski. He was Department of Defense for 10 years. So he served in the military. What do I care about that? No. I checked his service records. He was a Navy SEAL. I can give a flying fuck who or what he is. He killed my brother, and for that he's gonna pay. Seth, I don't think you understand the level of training and skill that it takes to be a SEAL. As far as killers go, this guy's the elite of the elite. I handled trained killers before. No, not like this, you haven't. Look, look, I'm not gonna go back and forth with you on this, all right? I want you to give me his address, or I'm gonna go public with your second income. You understand me? You do that. You go down with me. So be it. 6808 Sycamore. And you stay out of my way. Deacon, change of plans. now, huh? You're gonna be able to fight your way out of this one, Mr. Badass. This does not look good for me, does it? But who are you kidding, man? You don't know how to shoot that thing. What'd you say, motherfucker? Control the flame. Uh. 
enough. Bordis wants him alive. Sorry, Bobby. Hundred grand? It's a lot of money. Club ain't doing too good these days. Are you fucking kidding me? You set me up? Hey, you guys hold him down. He may not look like much, but this guy's a trained killer. You piece of shit. I took a bullet for you. Whatever, hero. Look, this ain't personal, man. It's just business. You fucking piece of shit. I should have let you die out there. You know, you really need to stop living in the past. I can see you, Bobby. Hey, what happened in No Man Left Behind? Over here, tough guy. Oh! I took a bullet for you! Stop making this hard on yourself. This ain't nothing compared to the second one. Let him go. What? I changed my mind. Let him go. What the fuck is wrong with you, man? I said I changed my mind. Let him go. Let him go. Go fuck yourself. Go fuck myself? Yeah, I'm taking him in. You're taking him in. Go fuck I'm myself. I'm fucking taking him in. You're taking him He's in. He's worth a hundred fucking thousand dollars. I'm taking him in. Am I not speaking English? I don't I said fuck what you're speaking, you big goofy motherfucker. I said I'm taking him <laughs> Telling me to go fuck myself? I thought we were friends. What? What? You're, you're sorry? Apology not fucking accepted. Fucking piece of shit. All right. Who wants to die first? <laughs> Just like old times, huh? Go ahead, man. Get out of here. These guys aren't going anywhere. Thanks, man. Hey, just one a favor. We're even. Honey, I'm worried about Bobby out there all alone. Should have done more to help him. Damn it. Baby, like, try and get some sleep, okay? I feel like a coward. I didn't do anything to help. Baby, yes, you did. You got us home safely. Did you see the way he took out some of those guys? It's more to him than what it appears to be. What do you mean? He's no landscape architect. That guy's a train killer. She's fine. I gotta see okay. Thank you, buddy. Did you get the bike, man? Huh. Hey, go back to bed, all right, buddy? I promise I'll tell you all about it in the morning, okay? Okay, we'll catch up in the morning. 
I want to know everything, the whole story. Good night, good night man. Wow, man, you look bad. Oh. oh my god, Bobby, thank god. They took Brianna. Oh, yeah. Oh, look at those two guys from the Mayan. Portis's men? Yeah, yeah, they said that they were gonna kill her if you didn't come and rescue her. Where? Where did they go? They, they abandoned Pierre by the bridge. Bobby, please. Kill that mother. No, wait, wait, Bobby, wait. Just wait a minute. Bobby, wait. Bobby, what are you doing? No. Bobby, I'm sorry, please, don't do this. Bobby, just call the police. Why don't you call Detective Briggs? Just see if he can help. Honey, I need you to go back in the house. I know what I'm doing. Well, you know what, Bobby? I don't think that you do know what you're doing. Dawn, I'm not asking you. I'm telling you. Go back in the house. This man broke into our house and took our door. Miss Kalinowski. All right. Listen, calm down. Tell me everything you know. When my dad gets here, he's gonna kick your ass, meatheads. <laughs> not likely. It's not nice to talk to people like that, kid. 
Didn't your daddy teach you anything? And I'm not a meathead. I went to community college. Did you graduate? No. Hello, sweetheart. My name is Seth. I'm a friend of your father's. I gotta pee. I'm sorry, dear. That just isn't gonna happen. Fine. Then I'll just go right here. Deacon, take her. <coughs> this way. Move it. Is everybody in position? Yes, sir. Perfect. Right here. Thanks. Hey, look over there. Yeah, right. Uh, oh, my gosh. What? <laughs> That's something my dad taught me. Meathead now. Come on. What the hell happened to you? A little bitch kicked me in the balls. And then she took off running. Idiot. Uh, Let me tell you something, Deacon. You let her get away again, and you're gonna be wearing your balls for earrings. You get me? Big moron. Something about her? Let her go. Ah, Officer Briggs. Welcome to the party. I said let the kid go. I don't take orders from you. It's none of your business. Why don't you do what you do best? Look the other way. Are you out of your fucking mind? Grabbing a kid? Kidnapping? What the fuck are you thinking? Well, would you look at this? A crooked cop with a conscience. How heroic. Seth, looking the other way on a drug deal is one thing. Grabbing a kid? You're over the line. Oh, am I? Because of that kid's father, Ethan's dead. The universe has to balance. That girl's father's a war hero. Your brother's a world-class asshole. Where's the balance in that? Don't you fucking call my brother an asshole! Oh, come on, man. Your brother's a smart-ass coke freak that pisses people off for a living. You included! Stop it. Who do you think told Nikki Wilcox what's on that tape? Huh? I'll tell you who. It was Ethan. Ethan's popping off to Nikki. And dumb luck for you, the junkie calls me. Shut the fuck up now, Briggs. Ethan Bordas. Always wanting to be Big Brother, Seth. Always wanting to be you. 
and resenting the fact that he would never be anything than your little brother. Truth is, that kid was so sick of being in your shadow that he had to get himself killed to crawl out from under it. Seth, your brother... Shut up! Ethan wasn't my brother. What? He wasn't my brother. He was my son. My son. You hear me? My son. When I was 16, I was fooling around with a girl upstairs, and she got pregnant. And her parents wanted to get rid of the kid, but my mother wouldn't have it. So when Ethan was born, we took him in. And she told everybody that he was hers. So you see, Briggs, me grabbing the kid of the guy that killed my kid makes perfect sense. Seth, it's not gonna bring your son back. No, I can fix this. It's not too late. You just give me the girl, and we'll go back to doing what we do best. I lied. Cop. I never liked that piece of shit cop anyway. Portis, if my daughter isn't released in five seconds, the next shot goes through your head. Don't move, Kalinowski, or I'll kill your daughter. Go ahead. What? I said go ahead. Then I'm gonna shoot your boss. Right between his eyes. Let it go, Deacon. Do what he says. Oh, I knew you'd come and save me. You OK, Bree? I am now. So what now, war hero? You going to shoot me? Well, that's up to you. I don't want to, but if you keep coming after me, what choice do I have? You win. Call your men off. It's over. Bobby Kalinowski's free to go. Let's go, baby. you for a little while. Oh. I know, baby. I'm sorry. You'll be safe in here. I love you, baby. I love you too, Daddy. Go kick their ass. Yeah, almost. You got a corner down to the new pier. 
No sign of the girl, though. Almost? What if I almost put my foot up your ass? Yes, sir. Move. Child, I'm gonna take yours. What? You know, Bordas. Ethan took his own life when he decided to attack my wife. Get up! Get up! All right, your move, big man. What are you gonna do now? Kill us both? No. Just you. No. Ah. 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 Okay, 
Meet Big Ronnie. Ronnie. Brianna. Hi. Pleasure to meet you. <laughs> Finally. Hey, man. Thank you. Right. Guess this makes us even, huh? No. <laughs> We're not even. I saved your ass like three times. You only saved me once. Even. Saved you in the park. Saved you from those two fat guys. Saved you from Ninja Boy. Saved me like two more times before we even. Wait, the park? Hey, you set me up in the park. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You still owe me. Who's he? An old whore buddy, baby. Well, he's cool. Yeah, he's cool. But you're cooler. But his tattoos were awesome. I want one. No, no tattoos. Please, Daddy, please. We're not gonna talk about oh, this, Bree. Just, just one, one little one. Wrong side, wrong side of town. I hit your ass up, you keep slipping out of bounds on the wrong side, wrong side of town. Keep playing around here, get your ass laid down, homie. Wrong side, wrong side of town. Holy cow, Mac Billy, nigga, catch a couple rounds on the wrong side, wrong side of town. They say I killed him, nigga, they say I stabbed him, homie, but it was self-defense, he was asking for it. Oh, hey, that's nigga, round the way, sent the nigga on his way, now it's paper on my face, yeah, it's paper on my face, they hit up in my waist, got the whole hood hot, yeah, I'm blowing out a trace, I'm posted in a the corner, they got a nigga stuck, here he in fair ropes, it's some cherry red chuck, it's some cherry red chucks, big dog do his thing, in that six-fold rag, niggas throw our game, I ain't trying to fill me up with lead. These niggas won't be dead. They was aiming for my head, but they hit me in the leg. It's murder, murder, murder. Kill, kill, kill. I was raised in the gutter. All I do is fight still. So when I'm keep coming, I'ma gun they ass down. But for now, for now, they got me on the wrong side, wrong side of town. I hit your ass up, you keep slipping out of bounds on the wrong side, wrong side of town. Keep playing around here, get your ass laid down, homie. Wrong side, wrong side of town. Holy cow, Mac Billy, nigga, catch a couple rounds on the wrong side, wrong side of town. Yeah, nigga, come on, wrong side of town. No key, ride through the hood in the Nova, and I'm pushing them boulders. Nigga, I'm a hood soldier, hit them up. Big homie told me go and flip them over, rip them up. Get the clap and sip them like a thriller jacket. They call the nigga slipping behind enemy lines, and I'm running out of bullets like I'm running out of time. My nine just jammed, and I'm a hit man. Now a nigga hate his job, kinda like the homie Cam. They got me trapped off Washington in the Oaks. They chase a nigga down on through the liquor store. I crept out the back, threw away the cat. Had to jack the Japanese man boys back. It's home, sweet home, goddamn killer Cali. Got a nigga feeling like Trey in that alley. A boy in the hood on the come up. Word to my little homies, never put your gun up when you on the Wrong side, wrong side of town. I hit your ass up, you keep slipping out of bounds on the wrong side, wrong side of town. Keep playing around here, get your ass laid down, homie. Wrong side, wrong side of town. Holy cow, Mac Billy, nigga, catch a couple rounds on the wrong side, wrong side of town. Nigga, you on the wrong side of town. Yeah, big dog, nigga, riding through that city slow, two miles per hour. Nigga, you see that six vote, 17 by nine days, homie. Smile for the camera, you know they hate me, homie. I'm a billion dollar motherfucking nigga. That's why I keep a finger on the tech, now I'm tricking. Yeah, it's so woo. Niggas can feel the pain. That nigga can't know about the beat of them lanes. He know about that F1 switch of four ways. Red line, flat line, nigga, it's all the same. I don't love these hoes, so when they trip, I bitch be a 45th in a presidential zip. They say I got the swag of Biggie in the presence of Mossberg. Oh shit, it's the resurrection of four bit. No tint on my phone, no sense in my brain. So run up on my shit and feel that flame on the wrong side, wrong side of town. I hit your ass up, you keep slipping out of bounds on the wrong side, wrong side of town. Keep playing around here, get your ass laid down, homie. Wrong side, wrong side of town. Holy cow, Mac Billy, nigga, catch a couple rounds on the wrong side, wrong side of town. Nigga, you on the wrong side of town.